morning class good morning mrs shora take your seats thank you madam madam yes teacher my mom told me that inyaja a color is a bag yes hey do you mean that i am mrs bag <laughs> <laughs> no madam i thought so How did it even start for your mom to say that? Anyway, hey, hey, G. If someone was to ask you about who you tell Mrs. Chola is, what would you say? I would say she's our class teacher. But why, G? You didn't get it. I'd say that she's Mrs. Bar. <laughs> Jerry and G. I can hear you from here. Whatever it is that you are saying, please stop it. We are sorry, madam. You better be. Today we'll be looking at a very important topic. You read at the count of four. One, two, three, and four. Surviving COVID nineteen. At the end of this topic, I expect each one of you to have full information about this topic, such that you will be able to answer any question based on the same and put into practice. Are we together? Yes, Mrs. Shola. Very good. We had a brilliant student at this school, Jim Choi. May he so rest in peace. How many of you remember him? All right, put your hands down. Talk about him briefly and his tragedy. Let's begin with you, Chantel, then Gabriel, and we move on like that. His father was from England and his mother is Zambian. On many occasions, he stood in front of the class to argue strongly against the existence of COVID-19. All these measures that were put forward by health workers. Yes, and that his arguments were an inspiration from his father. May his soul rest in peace. Who also never followed the COVID-19 safety measures and died of the pandemic. That's right, Jacqueline. After a short while later in 2020, one week after his father passed on, Troy died of the same COVID-19 pandemic. I hope he knows by now what it means to be sick. Um very good. What a perfect class I have. Clap for yourselves. So tell me, how can we survive the COVID-19 pandemic? According to health guidelines, wash hands with soap regularly or use an alcoholic based hand sanitizer in the absence of soap. To add on the point, avoid touching your face with dirty hands. Observing a physical distance of at least one meter apart. Wearing a face mask every time you go out in public places. Avoiding overcrowded places. Getting vaccinated. Staying at home when we have nothing important to do out there. Seeking medical help whenever we develop symptoms in the earlier stage. For those that tested positive, they need to just follow the medic safety guidelines. So, what are the symptoms of the COVID-19 pandemic? Fever, cough, shortness of breath, difficulty in breathing, chest pains and headache. Very good. What a perfect class I have. It appears there is no need to write in notes. That is true. Ouch! What is it, Gabriela? I hurt my hand. We hope you know by now what it means to be sick. Class dismissed. 